Good morning, YouTube. Today we're off to Bahol's Bee Farm. Oh, there it is. I, I did not even know that. It's right there. I'm not even joking, that wasn't planned. I knew it was close, but I didn't know it was here. But it's not a bee farm, I don't think. It's more than that. But here, we'll talk when we get there. It's right there. Arts and crafts, dive shop, spa, coffee deli shop rooms, and a restaurant. Beautiful already. It's got my name on it. It is quaint. This is gonna be an experience. Ice cream production, I hear they have great ice cream. Coconut splitting, grating, extracting. Cause I think you get to do some of this stuff. See, that could be you. I'm gonna have to get some honey. As pandemic hit, we stopped the bee farming since we have no access to order quality queen for the hive. For now, we get our supply of honey from the other beekeepers and local honey hunters. Oh, that's why. Okay, so there, there is no bee farming here currently. We diversified the business to food production, like ice cream making, using coconut milk, cassava processing for chips, and lupia wrapper. Oh, this is where your lupia wrappers can come from. And other local delicacies using our own resources, which is sustainable. The whole bee farm started with just four workers in 2000, pre-pandemic. There were 568 employees, 70% women. They do not farm bees currently. So now they get their supply of honey from other beekeepers and local honey hunters. Okay. So no bees today, ladies and gentlemen. Information reception. I would love information. <laughs> Yes, sir. Good afternoon. Ma'am, good talk. Which way is the restaurant? Restaurant, sir, downstairs. Welcome sign, just go down and then right. And then this tour, yeah, you do so all closer, of this? Yeah, we don't have a tour right now. Okay. But you can room around the area, sir, without any. Yeah. And you have rooms? Uh, yes. Sir. So restaurant and rooms right now. Yeah. All right, thank you. I'm one of your subscribers. Are you serious? Yeah, yeah. Awesome. Do you want to be in this video? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Really? Yeah. Awesome. Awesome. One of, hey, one, of the, one of the subscribers in his blog. Oh, that's so cool. I forgot your blog. There's so many of you. I am one of the survivors. Oh, that's so good. Thank you so much. Yeah. Thank you. What do you want? Do you want to say hello here? Hello. 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 <laughs> to one of the subscribers. One of the subscribers. That's awesome. Yeah. What, what are your names? Rose, Rose. Rose? Yeah, Sydney. me too. I'm from Australia, Sydney. Sydney. I'm one of your subscribers too. Oh, that's this so cool. I'm from Singapore. <laughs> I'm from My Singapore. Okay, Singapore, Sydney. And what about you? Uh, from the Philippines. <laughs> from the Philippines. All right, my own Buddha. <laughs> I'm okay. a subscriber. <laughs> awesome. Well, nice to meet you guys. Nice to meet you. I hope you see that in YouTube, eh? Yeah, yeah. yeah this is, I'm making a video right now. Okay. okay. Yeah, yeah. Okay. All right, well, have a great trip. Nice Enjoy meeting yourself. you. All right, bye. <laughs> Have a good rest of your trip. I love meeting subscribers. Okay, I think the restaurant is over here, but as you heard, wait, hold on. Here's ice cream. My own boontag. Is this ice cream made here? Yes. Ooh, I hear it's good. I have to eat first lunch, but then I think I need to try this. What, what flavors do we have here? Oh, uh, ube. Many more. <laughs> and many more. Yeah, yeah, you don't have to read them all. Thank you, though. Which one's your favorite? My favorite is avocado. Avocado? Okay. All right, I might come try that after after okay, I eat. Okay. Thank you. Oh, they're closed. A lot of things are closed here today. But look, you can get honey. We have to get honey. No, they're not closed. The light's just off. Lights are dim. Never mind. I lied. Not closed at all. I'm probably going to get a small honey. I think that's what you have to do here. Yeah, we'll have to get some honey since we're here. And we also have a frog right there. But that's not important. This looks like it used to be a coffee shop. A really nice property. This way to the restaurant. It's known for the view here. Let's see how good that is. And massages. I don't know if they currently have massages. But they, I think these are rooms, maybe. Hilo. Massage area. Oh, okay. All right. Thank you. <laughs> Hilo means massage. Yep. Okay. All right. Thank you. Salamat. You're welcome. <laughs>
nice scenery, nature, very lush and green. And here's the restaurant. Oh yeah, look at that view. You can't see that. <laughs> I can see, you can, with eyeballs, you can see that view. The camera didn't show up. Let me see if I can quick peek for you here. Beautiful view. Hello. Just one. Yeah, for the restaurant. High chair, okay. I'll take a high chair over there. Yes. All right, thank you, perfect, okay. okay. Salamat. Ooh, look at this. Beautiful. So I'll get this view as I eat. There's a beach over there. I don't know how well you're gonna be able to see that. So nice. Beautiful view. Oh, this is perfect. Come here on a nice day for lunch. It's a bit out of the town, probably 10, maybe 15 minutes outside of the main town. Let me look at the menu though. A pizza is 440, 360. Pasta is 380, 440. Scallops are 380. Mm, salmon. 600 white rice 40 so this is basically what you're gonna pay in restaurants around here in general i'm gonna do some protein honey glazed chicken let's do that organic roasted chicken chicken curry yep honey glazed chicken can i do the the honey glazed chicken please honey glazed chicken Palijo. How oh, about the rice? We have already rice. Uh, what do you want? Rice, red rice or white rice? White, please. White rice. And service water? You have yeah, serv it's okay. Okay, yeah, just service that's water. It? Yeah, that's yes. all. Honey glazed chicken with white rice. Yes, that's please. Thank you. Thank you. Peaceful. This was a good decision. I'll have to give you the verdict on the food though, but it seems most things are closed, as you can tell because the pandemic affected everything. I think it said 568 employees prior to the pandemic. And when you see a couple things closed, like the coffee shop, the tours are not actively running. I'm assuming they had to downsize because of the pandemic and everything. But tourism's coming back in the Philippines. It's 2023, end of April right now. So maybe they'll, they'll ramp everything up. But either way, I hear great things about the food. The restaurant, I'll show you that. I didn't really show you that coming in. It was a decent amount of people over there. This is some of the fastest food that I've ever seen come out. Probably five minutes for me. Might not happen for you. Here's the chicken. I'm this sweaty because I just came from the gym. Got a great workout, but I'm not presentable. I'm sorry for that. Definitely have to give that crispy skin in the bite. Let's see. Mmm. Mmm. -hmm. Oh yeah. Really good. That's some of the crispiest skin I've ever had on a chicken. Lunch and a view. Then we'll try the ice cream. I'm gonna eat, I'm gonna stop talking to you now. Say goodbye to our view. It's water, not wine. Don't worry. We're driving responsibly. Definitely one of the best views for breakfast though. Not nope, lunch or breakfast, they're for breakfast. And this is the main restaurant here. They have an ice cream station right here, but I'm gonna go back to the one outside that we saw earlier. That's a long line. Hmm. We can go to the other ice cream. Yeah, let's go back in there. You get a whole platter of ice cream, and I don't know what the nachos are. Good afternoon. Avocado. Dragon fruit, babano, malunga. I don't, I don't know what that is. I kind of know what that is. Boko is coconut. Dirty charcoal. What? Chocolate. Ube is purple sweet potato. Peanut kisses. Peanut salted caramel. That sounds good. This is a tough call. There's a part of me that wants to try charcoal. There it is. We have to try charcoal. Huh. 
<laughs> it's pouring down. It tastes like, it doesn't taste like charcoal. Hmm. I mean, it's good. I'm just trying to figure out what it tastes like. It's all gonna be good. That's how hot it is here. <laughs> Doesn't taste like charcoal. I don't know what charcoal tastes like. Came back for honey and to wash my hands. Coconut wine. Cups. Here's all the honey. You can get a big jug right there. This is what I would get. A little pure honey jar. 90 pesos. Wild honey, hard honey. Of course, we're gonna taste test the honey at the bee farm. First, I'm gonna do the wild honey. I don't know the difference between a wild honey and a hard honey. It's more liquidy than I thought it would be. Oh, did you wanna taste this? All right. Can I try? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, I, I don't work here. Oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> no, you're good. No, it's okay. You just try it. It's really good. Well done. Honey. Yeah, that one's not too strong. That's yeah. a mild one. How about this one? I don't know. Spicy. <laughs> Spicy. I haven't tried that one. Do you want more of that? No. Okay. Try this one. Try the hard honey. This is a camera, by the way. Is that okay? <laughs> Hello. <laughs> Hello. All right, this one, hard honey. How's the hard honey? Sweet, sweet. Much sweeter than this one. Yeah, the hard honey is much yeah. sweeter. I like the wild yeah. honey. This one's mild. Yeah, I like that one. It's this one. Um, Pure honey, uh, wild, honey. wild honey, yeah. I'm getting the wild honey. Is that this one? This is pure honey. I don't know if it's wild or hard. These both say wild. This one's much darker though. So I don't know what's going on with that. I'm gonna get some shampoo while I'm here. We'll get this one. Jonathan. Oh, hold on, sorry, my hands are full. Jonathan, nice to meet you. What's your name? June. June, nice to meet you. Where are you from? Here in the Philippines. Iloilo. Iloilo, oh, so you're here just on vacation? Seminar, for seminar. For sorry? Seminar. For a seminar. Oh, very good. How long are you in town for? Uh, three days. Three days. Awesome. Nice. And yeah, I live here now. All right. Uh, here. Yeah, in the home. Yeah, yeah. Where you came from? I uh, originally from the U.S. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, welcome to Bahol. Have you a good trip? <laughs> All right. Ayo, ayo. I'm Ping. Or Ilo, Ilo. Do you speak Isaya? Yeah. Okay. Well, then I'm Ping. <laughs> All right. See you. Have, have a good day. Please throw your stick in the trash bin. Found the trash bin. You could taste test mango spread, pesto spread, honey spread. We will make a purchase. We're not just taste testing. Look at this. You can get a dress or a, an outfit for your bottle. Very fancy. Got a gentleman here. All right. Get some wild honey, pure honey. Is this small one? Is this wild honey or? Okay. All right. That's the one I wanted. I like this one. It's mild. What is what is the malunge? Is that a fruit? It's, it's a kind of a vegetable. It's moringa. Moringa. Oh, that's healthy. That's good for you. Mm -hmm. Salama kayo, folks. Mm -hmm. I'm Ving. All right, got some honey. Traditional raffia weaving. Look at this. I would like to see this being done by a professional. I'm not a professional. I don't think I would do well with that. There's a bakery. Look, bread, muffins. Everything here seems to be fresh. Made right here. I have invented a new honey snack. Almonds, cashews, mm. 
Maybe a little more. We're feeling froggy. Eat this instead of a Snickers bar, ice cream. Might be a healthier option for your sweet tooth. You can get this all over. I've seen this in the mall. I've seen this in many different spots. So keep your eyes peeled. Keep your eyes peeled for Behold Bee Farm products in a mall near you. Lunch, view, and honey. Not a bad day. Here are a couple other videos from the channel. Thank you for watching this one, and I'll see you in the next one.